first time that I sang overseas was in England. I appeared at Royal Festival Hall. And after I had opened my program and sang two songs, I realized that I had scheduled three songs, one after the other, three songs about geese. Since we are on the same tack tonight, this afternoon, uh, we now approach uh, goose song number three. Goose song number three differs from goose song number one and goose song number two in that goose song number three is in two parts. My part and your part. I will sing. There are two young ladies here. One two years old, the other four years old. Two friends of mine. Two records. Now in reality. And they want to hear the next song. Which is a little bit of tear. One of them wants to hear a little bit of tear, the other wants to hear it. It's my funny way of clapping. I'll do both of them together. I don't mean together. One after the other. That'll be a trick, won't it? <clears throat> Legend had it that he had shaken hands with Abraham Lincoln. So he uh, listened to the song and he said, we must have that next week at the Soldiers' Reunion. Of course, I never said no. He said, how about the lad? And I said, I'll do it. And he said, if you will, I'll give you a dollar. Well, I'd heard of it. But I went into town and I sang a song. I didn't know until later that the song that I sang, the first reference to it in history, was in Samuel P. Tyler. He referred to it as the ancient Scottish air. I will find out where she has gone and kiss her lips and take her hand and walk among long dappled grass and pluck till time and times are done the silver apples of the moon the golden apples of the sun so, 35, 40 years ago I lived in New York and I spent a great deal of time with writers, Carl Sandberg, and Kenley Cantor, John Steinbeck. And um, they would get into wonderful discussions and I would listen. I was a young fellow and I didn't uh, And um, I remember some wonderful things. And they were discussing time once. Time is an interesting thing. I'll be 82. 81.
Well, anyway, this time thing reminds me Omar Khayyam. He had a nice thing about time. Omar said, Come fill the cup. Let the fire up spring. Winter's gone. And in the fire of spring, winter's gone. Out to the The bird of time has but a little way to fly. No, the bird is on the wing. Far away, look at his eyes. So I'm told. But when the mind makes a contract, the body can't fail. When you're over the hill, brother, you're over the She might. The first time that I sang overseas was in England. I appeared in Royal Festival Hall. And after I had opened my program and sang two songs, I realized that I had scheduled three songs, one after the other, three songs about deep. Since we are on the same tack tonight, this afternoon, uh, we now approach uh, Goose Song number three. Goose Song number three differs from Goose Song number one and Goose Song number two in that Goose Song number three is in two parts. My part and your part. I will sing. There are two young ladies here. One two years old, the other two. And they want to hear the next song. This is a little bit of fear. One of them wants to hear a little bit of fear, the other wants to hear it, and I think they have left. I'll do both of them together. I don't need another one. It's one after me. That'll be a trick on it. Legend had it that he was taken in to get to that. So he uh, listened to the song and he said, we must have that next week with me. So the reunion. How about the lad? Huh? He said, if you will, I'll give you a dollar. I didn't know until later that the song that I sang 
Find out where she has gone and kiss her lips and take her hand and walk among long dappled grass and pluck till time and times are done the silver apples of the moon, the golden apples of the sun. Thirty-five, forty years ago, I lived in New York, and I spent a great deal of time with writers, Carl Sandburg and McKinley Cantor, John Steinbeck, and um, they would get into wonderful discussions. And I would listen. I was a young fellow, and I didn't. I thought I better keep still until the singing started. And um, I remember some wonderful things. Uh, they were discussing time once. Time is an interesting thing. I'll be 82. Anyway, this time thing remind me. Omar Khayyam. He had a nice thing about time. Omar said, Come fill the cup and let the fire of spring winter's garment. And in the fire of spring, winter's garment of the Period of time has but a little way to fly. Lo, bird is on the wing. And there's... It's not the gray in the hair that makes a man old. Nor the faraway look in his eye, so I'm told. But when the mind makes a contract, the body can't fill. When you're over the hill, brother, you're over the hill. Thank you for you. And I want to thank the hospital. Something there last year. They came out pretty good. They did a good job. Little things like that, you know. If I hadn't been there, I might not be here. Nobody else would. There's the rub. Well, elsewhere. Uh, I want to thank, uh, especially my wife, Dorothy, who uh, goes to me every place. See if I get there. And without her, I couldn't make it. And I want a special thanks to her.